not say that. that. Misquoted, misquoted for sure. sure. At least I did not hear me say that. So I said we used, we used to make, make fun of the name. But yeah, but yeah he, he is obviously killing things out here. here. Yeah, so, yeah, so that corny comment comes, comes from a 2021 episode of the Undressing Room podcast, where L'Oreal host Eva Marcial and Dominique De Diva talked about the actor. I think that Michael B. Jordan is just like a nice, corny guy. And I don't mean that as a slight, right? I mean, we all know that the nice, corny guys treat you the best. This is Radio 2 TV. My name is DJ Harmony. And let's go ahead and hear what Joe had to say about how he felt about L'Oreal being treated by Michael B. Jordan. That's what she's doing. Uh, I'm, 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 she's mad, man. I'm not, so when you say kissing his ass, I will not take it that way. I, I, mean, I don't I, even know if she I wanna, really... I want to retract that because she wasn't kissing his ass. She was definitely doing her job. But again, now we professional. Now we, and she, how she handled it, 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 it was dope. So now we face to face. I feel like I want to get my shit off. That's a possibility. A lot of people do that in the industry. So let me tell you. Dog, you doing that to a girl is some corny nigga shit. I can see that. You being Michael B. Jordan today. Uh, allegedly sexy as man not, alive I'm in all of these blockbuster I movies I agree. during your highlight week you've probably never been more visible than you are right this second and that's what you do to her and if I bring back the white girl rumors then it's gonna sound even crazier then it's gonna sound crazier cause why are you talking to our sisters like that on the red carpet we don't talk to white bitches like that but I'm not gonna make it racist. They say I make everything racist. That, that was corny of him to speak to that girl like that. I'm not disagreeing. I would have made a Michael joke. Michael B. Jordan, that's why yeah, niggas call you corny. I would have made a joke off the air like, well, hey, Creed. Hey, hey, what's his nigga's name? I wouldn't have done that. Hey, Creed. <laughs> In case you were confused, that corny ass shit you did is why niggas think you corny. Yeah. In case you were off a little bit, as to why you niggas keep thinking that money hides corny. Mm. But you just said corny, not negative. I don't you like you that. You said me. corny is not negative. You said, I don't think it's negative. Well, it's well, like one of the moments corny. Corny. Because, it's, because it's your perception of the word. I'm telling you about mine. I, I'm telling you I, my perception of that word. As another nigga they call corny his whole career. Is not, is not that. Is there different levels of corniness? Because, okay, because, okay, here's the thing. What you're talking about in terms of this particular exchange between L'Oreal and Michael B. Jordan, the fact that being rich, famous, accomplished, etc., he still remembers that fucking slight years ago. Nothing wrong with that. Okay, so, but, 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 but having the wherewithal to, like, to, to address it, you know, on a red carpet. To a girl. To a girl. So, is that if it was a dude and he wanted to do that, I have no problem. Right. Because that's different a little bit. I wouldn't bit. have did it in the serious I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have did it there. I would have did it off camera. And too. shout out to her for being professional. She, yeah, she, 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 she had to get it right through that. Shout out to her. So, 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 so in calling him corny during that moment, is that the same level of corniness that is oftentimes thrown at? Russell Wilson, but he's just the perfect. The industry had to do when they were coming up. He did what he had to do. Walk around with his head shots to promote. He did what he had to do. Stop the hate. Take that shit off your skin. I'm not hating. I'm just saying. I'm just I'm just acknowledging why kids in high school. I promise myself I'll leave you alone. Usually pretty cruel. Why they would justify calling him corny? I promise myself and the people that I leave you alone. You need to stop. Keep that energy. You're doing ninety and a forty. Stop with the hate. That's hate. Mm -hmm. You like that other guy, his man, his co-host, whatever his name is. You like him? Oh, he's such a great star and all this, all this. You be hyping niggas. I ain't making me join that nigga. nigga. We start staying with him. Yeah, Joe, yeah, get your shit. Good morning. Morning. Good morning. Oh, and in case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. <laughs>